All right, welcome everyone. I'm Danny here from Rebel at the Lego booth at Star Wars Celebration. And today we're going to walk through the timeline of the 20 years of Star Wars. This year is the 20th anniversary. We start in 1998 when the beginning of the licensing agreement was formed with Lucasfilm, the partnership that made this incredible thing possible. And then moving on to 1999 is when we get the first launch of Lego Star Wars sets. This year we have the 20th anniversary Lego Star Wars sets that imitate those original sets um, to bring to life those awesome creations. And then moving along the line, we see we get more and more sets. Um, we start getting more iconic ships, the X-Wing, the Falcon, um, the TIE Fighter. Um, that was in the year 2000. And then as we move along here, 2001, we get our first bust here. This is the bust of Darth Maul right here. You can see it. We haven't seen one quite like that ever since then. Moving down along the line, we get into some of the newer sets. 2002, we see uh, some sets, some Star Wars Episode Two, and then we have the infamous Cloud City, the highly sought-after set, um, with some very exclusive minifigs, especially the Boba Fett fig right there with the arm printing and the leg printing. That was in the year 2003. Now, as we move over to this side, the more current years, we come to one of my favorite sets here. This is the first motorized Lego Star Wars set um, with the Power Functions motors. This is the walking AT-AT. You can see this video here of the actual set moving with Luke pulling up on the string there. And then coming along here, we can see 2011, we get the UCS Super Star Destroyer. This is the longest Lego set ever made and one of the uh, most largest UCS Star Wars sets. In 2013, you can see there's this video here. Uh, Lego built a life-size X-Wing all out of Lego bricks. Over a million pieces, I believe, were in this set, or in, the, in this build, and this is displayed in Times Square in New York City. And then finally, we get the introdu introduction of the Microfighter series in 2014, a bunch of small sets that you also get minifigs with. And then in 2017, we get the iconic UCS Millennium Falcon, modeled after the original UCS Millennium Falcon, which was in 2007. You can see that original picture there. This is the largest LEGO set ever made, the highest piece count. And then finally, we're here in 2019 with the 20th anniversary Star Wars sets I mentioned at the beginning. Each set includes one of the minifigs from the original sets that came out in 1999, and they have an exclusive back print and little plaque um, to commemorate the anniversary. So that's it for the timeline for the 20 years of LEGO Star Wars. Let us know in the comments down below what your favorite set from the era is. Thanks for watching, and have a great day. Hey everyone, I'm Danny from Rebel Lug here at Star Wars Celebration and today we are repping our new Rebel Lug shirts. If you want to pick these up, check out our merch store on Teespring. Link will be in the description down below.